Born to tenant farmers John and Audra Gregg near Ames, Oklahoma, it was the hard work on the farm that shaped the work ethic of Mo Anderson. From an early age, she plowed fields, milked cows, and brought the cattle in from grazing, walking the pasture lane. With a dream of becoming a music teacher, after graduating from Wacomus High School, she enrolled at the University of Oklahoma. The first in her family to earn a college degree, Anderson taught music for 14 years before entering the field of real estate. In 1975, she partnered to establish a Century 21 franchise in Edmond. Becoming the third highest producing office of 7,500, the company was sold to Merrill Lynch Realty, where Anderson served as district vice president. Her success did not insulate her from the oil bust of the 1980s, and at the age of 54, she started over. In 1993, an offer from Century 21's Dave Jenks ensured security and freedom from debt. However, a prior handshake agreement with Gary Keller would make her the first to pioneer a Keller Williams region outside of Texas. The Oklahoma region prospered and Anderson became the first CEO and co-owner of Keller Williams International. Beginning with 45 offices and 1,800 agents, today the company boasts 1,000 offices and nearly 200,000 agents in 35 countries. Known as the Velvet Hammer for uncompromising values and standards, her business acumen is fueled with faith and compassion. Under her leadership as vice chairman of the board, Keller Williams is the top real estate company in the world. They are also the most giving. We are number one in our philanthropic efforts. And when I was CEO, I started KW Cares. And that charity, which takes care of our people, and I've often said, if every business in the world had a philanthropic model like we had, there would be no need for any kind of welfare. And our people contribute to this effort of KW Cares to the tune of five and six million dollars a year. Anderson continues to cultivate the firm's culture and inspiring agents globally. She authored A Joy-Filled Life, Lessons from a Tenant Farmer's Daughter Who Became a CEO, to honor her parents and leave a legacy to her children, Rick and Karen, and her grandchildren, Andy, Connor, and Parker. To mentor the next generation of leaders, she launched the online community of moanderson.com. From high school graduates to CEOs, this community inspires, challenges, and celebrates its audience. Anderson's greatest legacy is her philanthropic giving. The belief that the higher purpose of business is to give, care, and share has resulted in rich blessings for the communities, charitable organizations, and ministries that hold a special place in the heart of Mo Anderson.